it's Ash from Super Videos back for another video for The Last of Us on HBO. On this video, we're going to be taking a look at some brand new behind the scenes photos that confirm they are filming a major moment from the video game. Stay tuned, we'll be right back to break these photos down. Alright, as always, before we jump into this, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to join our community, and press the bell to be notified when I upload more The Last of Us videos on the channel. If any of the shows on the left interests you, then you definitely want to subscribe and stick around because those are the shows that I react to or I cover in depth on the channel. All the links to my social media pages is also down below and in the description, so make sure to follow me in any of those. With that said, let's just dive right into these. These photos confirm they are filming scenes from the part in the video game where Joel and Ellie visit Colorado State University. If you are a fan of the video game, you know that there is a major moment that happens in this part of the game. This storyline involves Joel and Ellie going to the Colorado State University hoping to find some stuff that were left behind by the fireflies. But when they do find their way to the Colorado State University, they are attacked by the fireflies. And that's where Joel gets a pretty nasty injury, which takes him out of the game for a little bit. And we get to spend a bit more time with Ellie. So this first behind the scene photo is just a set piece that they've set up where we see University of Eastern Colorado. So they're definitely building a set to resemble University of Eastern Colorado. We see a few more photos here. As you can see, it's post-apocalyptic. So there's a lot of debris. Now what's very interesting is that they're actually filming these parts for the game in an actual college. So that's kind of cool. But in this particular photo, we can actually see a banner that says the 19th annual biomedical science conference hosted by the University of Eastern Colorado and it's dated October 13th to 17th of 2003. Obviously this is made up, it's not real, but it does confirm two things. One is the year where things started going bad, which is 2003, similar to the game. And also the other part of it that is connected is the conference that's being talked about in the banner is for biomedical sciences, which could connect to the last of a storyline in general and the cause of the outbreak and all of that. We do know that they were filming some scenes not from the video game, things that are going to be original to the TV show, which is going to give us a little more insight into what caused the outbreak in The Last of Us. So I'm assuming that this is also connected to that in some way, shape or form. We also do see this sign outside of the building, which is connected because it's the biomedical sciences building at the University of Eastern Colorado, or it's supposed to be, you know what I mean? But then we have this pretty interesting picture of a building that's been spray painted with the Fireflies emblem. We even see a trash can being spray painted with the Fireflies emblem as well. And then there's another one here. But this is very interesting because obviously if you remember from the video game, for those of you who have played, when Joel and Ellie go to the Colorado State University, they do stumble upon a couple of these graffiti and spray painted fireflies, firefly emblems. So this is definitely game accurate. But the other part that's very cool is that, again, if you've played the game, you know a big chunk of the story at this point is Joel and Ellie just riding through the Colorado State University campus on horseback. Now why that's interesting is because we see them filming this exact thing. There's tons of pictures of Pedro Pascal and Bella Ramsey as Joel and Ellie on a horse riding through the campus, which is supposed to be the Colorado State University campus. So it's pretty awesome. The big part of the game where Joel gets injured is at this point. So I'm assuming that we're not going to see much of Pedro Pascal filming for the next few weeks because at this point in the story, he's probably injured. And 
it's going to be more screen time for Bella Ramsey as Ellie. We have more pictures of Joel and Ellie or Pedro Pascal and Bella Ramsey on horseback, so that's cool. And then we see a few more photos of just the two of them together and everything like that. And we see Pedro Pascal here next to a trash can, which I'm assuming is the same one that has the Fireflies emblem on it. A few more photos related to that, which is cool. Again, more photos of horses around the campus where they're filming. And then we see more photos of the two of them on horseback, more photos of them. Not much to talk about here. It's just a lot of people taking pictures of the cast and crew. I'm assuming these are students in class because you may not believe this, but classes are actually going on and they're not online. Although they were online because of COVID and all of that, a few months ago, things have slowly returned to normal and classes are actually in person. So there's actual students sitting in class, watching, shooting an actual TV show outside, which is mind boggling. We can actually see some students here. They're in class, minding their own business. And in the background outside of their class is people who I'm assuming who are actually supposed to be fireflies running around. So that's kind of interesting and kind of weird if you think about it. But then we have more pictures of the cast and crew. And then we have this pretty awesome shot, Pedro Pascal and Gabriel Luna who play Joel and his brother, Tommy. The two of them look very close to their video game counterpart, at least when it comes to how they're dressed and how they come off from pictures alone. But there isn't much more to talk about here, just a bunch of pictures of cast and crew filming scenes for when Joel and Ellie go to the Colorado State University. Now, it is very interesting that Tommy was there. I don't know whether they're changing the story and having Tommy being there at this time because in the video game, that wasn't the case. Or whether the actor that plays Tommy just showed up in set for whatever reason. We also see them decorating a few fences outside of the campus with a downtown area view. So I'm assuming they're going to be utilizing that to some extent and possibly using CGI to change it up a little bit and make it look more like Colorado. Other than those scenes, we do also have some more pictures from the quarantine zone. Now, these are obviously from earlier on in the game, but they haven't filmed all of the scenes for that yet. There's still more scenes that they need to film, I'm assuming, but we do see this set piece, which is a quarantine zone from early on in the game with the Fedra emblem in one of the posters. Not much more to talk about here. It's just a pretty interesting look at what the TV version of the quarantine zone is gonna look like, but not much that we can actually break down in this video or anything that can give us an indication of what they're doing. And obviously, like I said earlier, they're gonna use CGI to change things up slightly, especially things that are in the background. But what is also very interesting, and this is something that someone that was in the area wrote, they actually set up blue screens all around the inside perimeter of the quarantine zone, which means that they're definitely going to be utilizing CGI, especially when we have shots of the inside of the quarantine zone. But that's pretty much everything that I wanted to go through in this video. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, make sure to share and smash the like button, subscribe to join our community and press the bell to be notified when I upload on the channel. That's it for this video, see you next time for another super video.